Hey guys, welcome back to our channel. So today I have this unit here by Otri that I've been dying to review since I saw it came out. This is the lace front wig. It's a Swiss lace wig with a Swiss lace L parting. So the parting space, this is the L part. I don't know. To me, I think, I well, I thought L part used to be the shape, right? Like when they say U part and stuff like that. But it's just a little part. It's about, I would say like four inches deep. Not that what, not that deep. Um, I just added powder to it. That's it. But guys, she's called Amia or Maya, and I'm wearing her in the color 2T slash 425. So this is what the stock card looks like, and I'm pretty sure you guys have seen this picture before, whether it's on social media or whatever. So pretty. So I've been dying to review this, and I really wanted it in the same color as well. Now on the stock card, if you look at it, it looks a bit. On the silkier side, to be honest, it looks a bit tamed and so neat and smooth, but I mean, it's the stock card, so of course, it's going to look like that. But the hair actually has some volume to it, and I don't, I don't mind at all. <laughs> it actually has some volume to it. It has like a, it's like a light yaki hair texture, but it feels, mm, how should I put it? I don't know how to explain it, but it just feels like... Ugh, I don't know how to explain it, but anyway, <laughs> it has a light yucky texture, but you get a lot of volume with it. Um, if you want it like smooth and stuff like that, you would have to like use either some oil sheen or wig spray or you know some type of lightweight oil, something like that, some type of product in it to like tame it down. Not really tame it down, but like smoothen it out and everything like that. Um, I like it like this. It didn't come with any baby hairs, and I didn't add any either, so. This is it right here. This is what it looks like. Didn't add any baby hairs to it. But the... Look at the front. Let me come closer. You see the front? So it's kind of dense, but not that dense. Because you know, like, sometimes at the front you get like a... It's really, really thick. I mean, it's not that dense, but at the same time it's still a little bit dense so you might want to like tweeze it out a tiny bit be careful because you can run into the tracks but you know you might want to tweeze it out a little bit add some baby hairs and stuff like that make it look a little bit better but this is it and in terms of the cap it's a basic cap construction so you have two combs up front one at the back the adjustable straps and yeah it's just a basic cap construction but you guys I like this hair I mean it's not all that I expected it to be I'm not that excited about it anymore, but I have been dying to review it, so let's just get that out there. I did receive some shedding from this. Didn't receive any tangling or anything, but I did receive some shedding, so keep that in mind. Um, it is heat safe up to 400 degrees, so if you want to curl it up some more or flatten it out, you can definitely do that. It's basically layered all the way. And another thing I'm not so crazy about is the fact that the ends come down a little bit thinner. Maybe if I were to wear this out, I would just like trim it, trim it up to here. Maybe I think it would be better. I think that would be better than this little thin piece because this is all the hair to the front. So I just don't like this little thin piece down here. I think it would be better like this. But anyway, this is it. All the instructions come on the back of the stock card. But yeah, like I said, this is it. If you have any questions about this hair, if you've purchased this before, tell me what you think about it. If you like it, if you don't like it, let me know your thoughts down below in the comment section. Like, subscribe, follow us on all our social media accounts, and I'll see you guys really soon. Bye.